Now that the Missouri non-prosecutor has issued a sweeping non-indictment of Darren Wilson, we can finally find Michael Brown's real killer. Who killed Michael Brown? It's a real whodunit. Was it the black-on-black crime in the neighborhood that forced Brown to tackle a police officer's bullet with his head? No? Well, it must have been the cigarillos that pushed him into a competent and level-headed police officer's line of fire. And if not the cigarillos, it must have been his sheer size that killed him. Weighing in at 6'4", 292 pounds, Brown terrified Officer Wilson, who was only 6'4", 210 pounds, plus the additional weight of the club, gun, and police vehicle. Was the real killer Hulk Hogan? Had Officer Wilson not been so scared of the wrestling superstar, he would not have confused an unarmed teen with a world heavyweight wrestling champion, Tights and a Boa. The real killer was most surely a culture of violent rap music, broken homes, sagging pants, marijuana socks, social media, divorce, demonic weight gain, disrespect, hip-hop, happy meals, Obama, and sunspots. And thanks to the innocent bystander with a gun, we have plenty of leads into who killed Michael Brown. It's a real whodunit.